Hi, I'm Nadine and welcome to Staples Tech TV. With so many digital cameras available these days, choosing the right one can seem overwhelming. One of the first questions you should ask is what kind of camera should I get? Point and shoot or digital SLR? So let's take a look at each of the benefits of each type. Point and shoots like the Sony Cybershot H90 are compact, easy to use digital cameras that are designed mainly for the casual photographer. The immediate physical benefits of a point and shoot like the Cybershot H90 are its size and weight. It's small, lightweight and portable, so you can just slip it into your pocket and go. You don't need extra bags or any other accessories to carry it around. Sporting a 16.1 megapixel sensor with stabilizing 16 times optical zoom, the H90 shoots crisp photos and records HD 720p video. This big and bright 3-inch LCD screen makes it easy to review your shots and adjust your menu options. If you're looking for a point-and-shoot camera for your next vacation, then you're definitely going to want to check out the Fuji FinePix XP50. It gives you four-way protection. It's waterproof, freeze-proof, shock-proof, and dust-proof. Basically, wherever you go, the XP50 can handle it. This 14-megapixel camera can go 16 feet underwater and capture 1080p HD movies and still images with a wide-angle 5 times optical zoom lens with waterproof coating. And since it's also dustproof, it's better for locations like sandy beaches, parks and campgrounds than non-dustproof models. The 2.7-inch LCD screen features an anti-reflective coating that gives you excellent visibility, even in full sunlight or underwater. If you are more concerned with taking professional looking photos, then consider a DSLR, like the Canon EOS Rebel T2i. There are a variety of lenses that you can customize your angle of view. You can use anything from wide angle to telephoto. The Rebel T2i is compatible with the full line of Canon EF and EFS lenses. DSLRs offer a number of adjustable functions like aperture, shutter speed, and white balance, each capable of full manual control. To keep things easy, the Rebel T2i features a new quick control screen button for quick access to your most frequently used settings. But the biggest advantage of DSLRs is the near instant shutter response, making it easy to capture sharp images of moving subjects like a bouncy puppy or sprinters across the finish line. The T2i is exceptionally fast. It powers on and shoots in under 0.3 seconds, and it supports continuous shooting at 3.7 frames per second. Capture all those split-second moments with ease and accuracy. Excellent. One more big difference between the two types of cameras is how you see the scene. In a point-and-shoot camera, the viewfinder is usually a simple window through the body of the camera that gives you a rough idea of what's in the frame. With a DSLR, you actually see the image in the frame before you press the shutter button. <laughs> Excellent! The T2i lets you see your images and videos on a 3-inch LCD screen with a 1040K dot resolution, which equals to over a million on-screen pixels. This makes it possible to see 100% of the captured image with no borders. And the anti-reflective, water-repelling coating makes it easier to see the screen in bright conditions and from different angles. When you're deciding on what type of camera is right for you, ask yourself how are you going to use it and how much you're willing to spend for more creative control. And remember, you don't have to limit yourself to just one camera. You can use a high quality DSLR for special occasions and a less expensive point and shoot for everyday photos. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and leave your comments below. 
This is Nadine signing off for Staples Tech TV. See you next time.